Well, this entire week has been packed with several different changes happening in and around Lucas County revolving around the coronavirus pandemic. And tonight we're pausing to break down some of the important information so you can better understand all the mandates now in place. Here's Roxanne Elias. In Toledo, the week of July 13th began with the mask ordinance signed by Mayor Wade Capsicabbage on Tuesday. This meaning everyone in the Glass City would have to wear a mask while out in public. Then, just days later... The announcement came that Lucas County uh, has become red under the governor's uh, coding system. On Thursday, Governor Mike DeWine announced Lucas and Wood counties were now under a red alert warning, meaning a mask mandate. During his briefing, he also explained why Lucas County was placed in level three. Their numbers have moved into an area of concern with 393 cases over the last two weeks. The average number of cases has more than quadrupled over the last three weeks. ER visits have doubled. People seeing their doctor with symptoms have tripled. The mask mandate went into effect at 6 this afternoon in both counties. What this means is you will have to wear a mask when out in public and at any indoor location which is not a residence. If you are outdoors, a mask is needed if you are unable to maintain a 6 feet distance from anyone who's not a member of your family. Also, while waiting for or riding or driving in public transportation, car service, private car service, or ride-sharing car service. However, the mask mandate does not apply to any children who are under the age of 10 or if you're unable to safely wear a face covering. Also, those who are planning to visit a gym can also take off their mask while working out, as long as there's a six feet distance. Toledo mayor now hoping it's a wake-up call to all who have not been under a mask ordinance. It's a sign of how serious this problem has gotten and it's yet another indication that we, um, it, in a lot of ways after all these months, I, I, I really worry that we're almost back to square one uh, when it comes to dealing with this crisis. Roxanne Elias, WTOL 11.